Hi there everybody, this is my daily blog for March the 27th. All right, so this is Saturday. Let's see what's going on. So we still do have the Virgo moon and it's going to be opposite both Uranus, um, not Uranus, sorry, and Neptune and uh, Mercury in Pisces. Okay, so Neptune and Mercury in Pisces are really good together because it's just um, gives you inspiration. So it's inspiration, imagination, and it helps you to connect and tune into your inner wisdom. So we love that. And, you know, with the opposite, with the moon right opposite in Virgo, then it allows you to just go that little bit deeper with your emotions and a little bit deeper to get some clarity about how you're feeling, um, what, you know, what you want to do, how do you want to work, move forward, and how you want to put like your thoughts, feelings, and more uh, importantly, that inner wisdom and intuitiveness, your instinctual senses, how do you want to put that into action, okay? Because Virgo is a doer, it's thinker and doer. They like to think, they like to organize, and they, you know, follow through and, and you know, get things done. So with the whole um, Pisces energy with the Neptune and um, Mercury, it really is helps you just be inspired. But to get that inner wisdom, that inspiration, that imagination going, you really need to slow down and take some time out because I've said this many times if you've been watching me for a while, <laughs> you'll know it's one of my favorite things to say because I really believe it. It's like when you're busy, busy, busy all the time, there's no room for inspiration, inspired thought, imagination, and those aha moment to come through because you're just too busy. So, you know, find something. For me, it's movies. You know, when if I can sit down on a weekend and have some time out and watch a couple of movies, then I think seem to just sort themselves out in the back of my mind somehow um, because I get out of the busyness um, space of doing things and so whether it's a walk or reading a book or just get do something that puts your mind into a different space okay and allow those thoughts to filter through. All right so love, luck and blessings to you. I hope you have a great weekend and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye for now.